Flav City family, what is up? It is Bobby coming at you in the parking lot here at Aldi. Going to make a video called A Cheapskate's Guide to Eating Healthy. It's not necessarily for cheapskates. It's just a funny way of saying how to eat healthy on a budget, which, if you pay attention to the news, is becoming a little tough because inflation is rearing its ugly head and it's becoming more expensive to buy healthy items. But if you know how to shop, you can still get top-notch healthy items at a really rock-bottom price. So what I want to do is go to different grocery stores like Aldi, Walmart, Costco, Trader Joe's, and more, and show you how to buy healthy items when it comes to pasta, bread, beef, chicken, and more, because I'm all about helping you put the best quality stuff in your body for seriously low prices. Um, I do also want you to check out thrivemarket.com using my promo link down below, which is now 40% off your first order. Thrive is a six-year supporter of the channel. And if you don't have access to a lot of stores like Aldi or Walmart close by you, Thrive is really nice because they have the stuff that most grocery stores have, but it's cheaper. You save about $32 per order and the box comes to your door. But right now, when you click my link down below, you get 40% off your first order, which is normally 25% off. It's 40% off your first order. It's a free gift also, and it's 30 days risk-free. So try out Thrive using my link down below. I love them. Okay, less talking, more shopping. Let's go to a lot of stores and show you how to save money. I have whole videos dedicated to bread, what to look for, what to avoid when you're buying bread. But here at Aldi, they have one of the healthier breads on the market for one of the cheapest prices you can get. And it also has one of the best names too. It is Knock Your Sprouts Off Organic Sprouted Seven Grain Bread. So many interesting things going on here. But for my fellow budget people out there, $2.99 for a loaf is the cheapest price you're ever gonna find. So let's just go over this. If you eat gluten and grains, organic is a must. Why? Because non-organic wheat can score high in the active ingredient in Roundup called glyphosate. But what I love here is the word sprouted. So when I flip it around here, you have organic sprouted wheat berries, you have a touch of honey, but you have sprouted millet, sprouted rye, organic oats, sprouted barley. Look at these ingredients here, my friends. It's one gram of sugar from the honey, and it's not low carb, but it's nutrient dense sprouted grain bread. Sprouted grains are the most, repeat, the most nutritious, uh, nutritious, nutrient dense grains you can get. Why? Because when you sprout them, number one, they're easier on your tummy to digest. Number two, the sprouting process unlocks more nutrition for your body to absorb. So you're getting all of that and then knock your sprouts off. You're getting USD organic, but you're also getting $2.99, which is fantastic. So if you eat gluten, if you eat grains, this is one of the best deals you can get. I talk about cooking oils a lot and Walmart has a great selection. I have whole videos about this. And just to summarize, for healthy cooking and healthy living, you never, ever, ever wanna use any kind of canola oil, vegetable oil, Crisco, corn oil, sunflower oil, soybean oil, safflower oil. For the 100th time, I'll say it again, those oils are processed to death, so processed with so many chemicals, they're inflammatory and they're loaded with free radicals that destroy the cells in your body. So I love oils like extra virgin olive oil, avocado oil, virgin coconut oil, at Walmart, especially a super center, if you can find one, they have an amazing selection of extra virgin olive oils and they have one of the two best prices between here and Costco, I'll talk about in a second. But this one is pretty much at every Costco I've been to. And what I love about this is yes, California knows how to party, but they make really good olive oil. And this is from Cobram Estate. This is actually really important because it's only from this estate in California. Also important, wow, $6.97 for a 12.7 fluid ounce bottle of single estate olive oil. Now this is important because when you start getting blended oils, they might be cheaper, but olive oil, I have a whole video about this too, is rife with fraud. Uh, olives can be blended from many different countries, oftentimes inferior quality, that might be old, moldy, or spoiled, or cut with other oils. I don't like, I'm not saying this guy do it necessarily, but I don't like when it's blended from different countries. These guys do make a pure California olive oil, but it's more expensive. I like these guys right here because they're just from California and the price is right. I also noticed this. This is Italian single estate olive oil here for another phenomenal price right here. So I would first look for that one because I see it at a lot of Walmarts. And if you see this one too, the estate Italian one, 
that's great. I only cook with extra virgin olive oil because when you get to regular olive oil like this, olive oil like this is one step processed past virgin. I don't like that. Plus, I mean, if you are going to use an olive oil, the Great Value brand is not going to be the highest quality in my opinion, but you want extra virgin olive oil for cooking. Yes, extra virgin is 100% safe to cook with. They do it in Italy. They even deep fry in it. Extra virgin is the way to go. One of my favorite cooking fats actually is ghee but 100% grass-fed ghee. Unfortunately, more, most stores, it's pretty expensive, but the one you see me using a lot at home is uh, from Thrive Market. Their Thrive Market branded organic, 100% grass-fed ghee is fantastic. Price is better than most grocery stores, but with the 40% off promo code, when you click my link down below, it's a great deal. I use it all the time for eggs, for searing steak. Uh, also, my link takes you to my shopping list that has all of my Thrive Market faves. So try it out, get the 40% off your first order, the free gift, and it's 30 days risk-free. Uh, the other store that has the best extra virgin olive oil at the best price would be Costco. I've talked about it many other times here at Costco, but this bottle in particular, their 100% Italian extra virgin olive oil, Rosie, is one of the best olive oils on the market. You're sitting backwards. Um, this has been tested in individual um, lab studies as being pure, and that's a problem with a lot of olive oils. Like I said earlier, a lot of them rate as fake or cut with other oils. And not only is it a good quality extra virgin, the price is great. You're not gonna beat that price. The Walmart one is very nice, but this is even better. And don't worry, even if you're not a Costco shopper, you can come here with a friend like Mira Rose, who is a Costco shopper, or if someone gets you a Costco gift card, you can come here also and shop without being a member. So that's a great hack to get into the warehouse and get this Primo extra virgin olive oil for a great price. When you're talking about crackers, 99% of them on the market are not gonna be healthy at all. But what if I told you behind me on this wall is one of two on the market that are healthy, have best in class ingredients, and are keto and diabetic friendly? Check this out. The first one is gonna be here at Aldi. Keto Savorites Aldi brand crackers. Everything seasoning, my favorite, and cheddar makes it better. Here's the deal. Keto crackers are nice because it's gluten-free, it's keto and diabetic friendly, but they can be pricey. But a four ounce bag, which is pretty sizable, for $2.99, also known as 74 cents an ounce, is a great deal when you have ingredients like this. Check this out, this is the cheddar. So. There's no grain, there's no gluten. It's almond flour based, it's cheddar cheese. There's a touch of tapioca starch there. There's eggs and garlic and that's it. My only gripe with this is that the milk from the cheese is not non-GMO, but I'm gonna give it a pass because it's such a unique product. How do you get net carbs? Six minus two, that's four net carbs per serving. Personally, I like these better. It has the everything bagel seasoning here and the flavor and texture is crispy as can be. So here's where I say, even if you weren't looking for a keto diabetic cracker that's gluten-free, why would you eat the other stuff? The other stuff is downright unhealthy. I could pick anything I want here. In fact, I talked about goldfish on another uh, video the other week. Most of your crackers are made with enriched wheat flour. I can't stress it enough. When you see enriched wheat, it used to be whole wheat. They strip it down to a simple carbohydrate and then enrich it with niacin, iron, iron thiamine, vitamins to make it healthy again. Well, that's just so ridiculous because you're taking out the natural one and putting in uh, synthetic vitamins. Then you have GMO, canola oil, sugar. This is true for most crackers on the market. I vouch, like I'm in the mob, right? I vouch for these crackers right here. They taste great. That's number one. The second cracker would be at Costco. This one right here, it's the keto crackers that taste great and they have these at Aldi also, but at Aldi they're a dollar an ounce. You're not gonna beat this price at 53 cents an ounce. And this is the second keto cracker. That's a great price on the market. The only thing I don't love per se about this is see how it has natural flavors as the last ingredient there. I don't love that, but it's still allowed in this instance and it's still Bobby approved because it's a keto diabetic friendly next level cracker. And like I said, the alternative is something like this that has processed oils or a horrible Ritz or a goldfish cracker. So either at Aldi or this one at, uh, at uh, Costco is a great price for a healthy nutrient dense cracker.
Let's talk about beef. You may have noticed the price of beef go up recently. Heck, walk around any grocery store. The price of almost everything is going up because inflation is sky high. Combine that with the COVID supply chain uh, constraints, you have a bad combination. But if you know how to shop around like I do, you can find really good deals on beef. Like here at Aldi, you can get 100% grass-fed, grass-finished ground beef. That's organic for a staggeringly low price of $4.49 per pound. That is one of the best in the business. Now, currently this is an Aldi Sabre. I think the non-family pack, which is the non-three pack, is a little more expensive, but stock up, throw this in your freezer because at $4.49 uh, a pound, $4.49, I'm sorry, at $4.49 a pound, it's cheaper than this. This meat is $85.15, this one's $85.15. This is 100% grass-fed. This is grain-fed, GMO-fed, factory-farmed beef. And it's more expensive. I talk about this all the time. But when you have the choice, and luckily we have a lot of choices these days, 100% grass-fed beef is the way to go. It's better for the environment. More importantly, I think also, it's better for you. Nutritionally speaking, it's more nutrient-dense. It has more vitamin D, more vitamin uh, B, vitamin A, conjugated linoic acids, grass-fed beef is where it's at. It can be expensive at certain stores, but Aldi has one of the best prices ever. And like I said, $4.49 versus $4.69. I would not eat factory farm GMO, meaning the cows only eat GMO corn and soy, uh, feed this kind of beef when you can get this beef and load up. So uh, Aldi is one of the best places to get it. The other good place is Walmart. Ah, look at this. Walmart is currently sold out of the grass-fed beef at $4.96 a pound. They do have this one here, but it's more expensive. And if you notice, it's 90-10. It's 90% beef, 10% fat. This one, I know for a fact, from memory, is 80-20, which is the best because I wanted all these actually 85-15, and more fat is better because the lean one will dry out, and this is pasture-raised grass-fed fat. So $4.96 is great. For that current Aldi Fine Family sale price of what was it, $4.46 is even better. But between Aldi and between the price here at Walmart, that's the best you're gonna do on fresh, never frozen, 100% grass fed beef. I'll give Aldi credit for organic chicken, which is a must from the grocery store because non organic chicken is basically GMO factory farm chicken. The price of $5.89 per pound is about as low as they get. But I have a better deal for you. If you buy whole chicken, you're gonna get a better bang for your buck and you can use the scraps or the leftovers to make chicken soup. Well, this is nice, they have organic whole chickens here for $5.27, but do you remember in my Trader Joe's video last week about the top 10 things to buy at Trader Joe's now? Trader Joe's has the best chicken you can possibly get. They have pasture-raised, slow-grown, heritage-breed, non-GMO chicken. And if memory serves me correct, that was $3.49 a pound. So that chicken is the best you can get. $3.49 a pound versus $5.27, the answer is clear. Go, go to Trader Joe's, get that chicken, pasture-raised chicken, once again, is more nutritionally sound than factory-farmed chicken. Even the organic chickens never go outside, but because it's slow-grown and heritage breed, it's the same variety the chicken was back 50 years ago it tastes better and has a better texture. So hightail it down to Trader Joe's because in my opinion, they have the best quality chicken at the best price with that pasture raised whole bird. Can pasta be part of a healthy diet? Well, the answer is yes, if you eat the right pasta. And the right pasta is made from nutrient-dense ingredients like chickpeas or legumes. The wrong pasta is the stuff that we all grew up with and many of us still eat today. I talk about this a lot, but if you're eating traditional pasta made from wheat, whether that's durum wheat or semolina wheat, this is not good for you. Why? This is wheat pasta. It's simple carbohydrate pasta that does nothing but spike your blood sugar and has no nutrition. There's no reason to eat this because we have so many alternatives now. And Aldi is one of two places that has a great price on chickpea pasta. They have rotini, they have penne, but sometimes you can find them made of lentils and other legumes. A 12 ounce package for $2.69 is one of the best deals around. And I actually prefer chickpea based pasta and they make them in the shape of uh, spaghetti. I've seen chickpea rice from Monza before. The reason I like that is number one, it's one ingredient, but chickpeas are incredibly nutrient dense. My friends, when you have a one cup serving 
that has 11 grams of fiber and 19 grams of protein, you have a powerhouse nutrient-packed pasta here. That is so much fiber that, heck, I wouldn't stray too far from the toilet. That is like colon blow. This is amazing when you compare it to that. That has basically no fiber and no protein and is gonna do nothing but spike your blood sugar. This actually is not gonna spike your blood sugar that much, and I know that because I ate it while uh, wearing my uh, glucose monitor. This is such a great way to get your pasta on. You don't wanna overdo it, but this is a very nutrient dense way to do it. And that pasta price there for this pasta is fantastic. The other place that is a great deal also, Trader Joe's. Uh, we just talked about it in the video the other week. Their pasta made of brown rice and yellow lentil spaghetti is one of my favorites. It's an OG Trader Joe's staple. And what's great about it is it has those nutrient dense uh, lentil and brown rice. It's fiber rich, it's um, protein rich, and the texture is just like normal spaghetti and the price is right. So between that over there and this one at Trader Joe's, two of your best healthy pastas in the game. Can you hear that? The birds are chirping. This Walmart parking lot is like the most scenic parking lot I've ever been to in a grocery store. It's lovely, uh, but I digress. Uh, that is it for a cheapskate's guide to healthy eating. It's getting harder. Prices are going up, inflation's going up, but if you know where to shop and you know where to look, you can still get great healthy items at rock bottom prices. Uh, but that is it. Make sure also to check out thrivemarket.com using my promo link down below. The 40% off your first order is not gonna last long and that is a fantastic deal. Plus you get the free gift and my landing page will show you all of my Thrive Market favorites. But from the grocery store, my second home, I leave you like I always do. Hashtag keep on cooking. Mad love and peace. Later.